Hey guys, tons of fun here with November's Loot Crate. Took a while to get here and I had to go to the post office, but I have it and I want to unbox it for you guys. It's going to be the first one, so it'll be a little rough, but stick with me. So there she is, the old Loot Crate. And of course I got it all nice and sealed up with tape, so I got to bust out my trusty pocket knife. Now cover kids, don't cut yourself. All right, hey, look at that. That's some pretty nice presentation right there. All right, so let's see what we have in here. First up, we have a Blizzard cute and cute but deadly Series 1 figure. All right, what are our possibilities here? Looks like we've got Kerrigan, Arthas, Sylvanus, Sylvanus, uh, Zeratul, Murloc, Diablo, a uh, Murloc exclusive to Loot Crate, another Murloc, and another Arthas. So there's our possibilities there. All right, let's open the sucker up. <laughs> they continue to hide it by using foil. But it's got cool little figures and stuff on it, if you can see there. Nice little nib to help you open it. I'll let you guys see it first. What do we got there? Oh, Diablo! Rock and roll Diablo! Ah. All right. Oh, he doesn't sit up very well. <laughs> Fair warning, Diablo does not like to stand up on his own. There we go. We'll set him right here. I'm sorry, I'm off the side. All right. Ooh, nice. Up next, we got some shredder shades. Oh, yeah. I'll put these on later for you guys. Check those out. Shredder gonna shredder. Officially licensed Nickelodeon material. Yes. There we go. Focus. Oh yeah. Sport those sweet boys right there. Ooh, next up we have a really nice little mocking J pin from Hunger Games Part 2. Or what I like to call Boring J Part 2. Could have been a lot more action for my taste, but it was alright. It's a nice little pin. I'm gonna leave that in the package right there. But it's a nice metal pin. It's not bad. All right, ooh, here we go. Volt Boy Bobblehead, Oh yeah. All you Fallout fanatics out there currently playing Fallout 4. I'm not playing it yet, but I'm gonna wait and play it when all the patches are out and we got some great mods to play around about in February. And of course, we got some more sticker tape here. Bust out our trusty knife. Oh wow, that is actually a very nice bobblehead. What's that? What's that, Bolt Boy? Yeah, Timmy's stuck in a well? Nah. Bolt 111. All right, that is pretty cool. I like that bubble head. All right, what do we got here? Gift of Geek. Happy Holidays Looter. At Loot Crate, we try to make our crates a special gift you'll enjoy. Use these tags to celebrate the spirit of the holidays and share the love with your geeky friends and family. Regift your loot to someone. Oh, that's kind of cool. So they give you some nice Loot Crate gift tags if you want to re-gift anything from your Loot Crate. Let's see, we've got a little pin here. Loot Crate, November 2015, combat! Let's see if we can focus in on that. Can we, there we go. Loot Crate 2015, pow! Oh, look at that. What are these? Oh, these are actually refrigerator magnets of the deadly, acute but deadly Blizzard figures. I'll have to adorn my refrigerator some of these, huh? And 
And of course you got the Loot Crate magazine. Always has stuff in here. Talking about previous Loot Crates, video games, Loot Crate unboxings, Mega Crate, 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 Crate. Man, I don't know, the guy who won this Mega Crate made off with some good stuff. Street Fighter V, Collector's Edition PS4, Ryu, an actual controller. Looks like a, is it the Amazon, uh, the Amazon Home Automation Kit? I mean, it's pretty, stuff, pretty nice stuff in that Mega Crate. Oh, yeah. DMT Shredder Sunglasses. I'll have to wear some of that out there, huh? All right, and it looks like last, oop, let's see if we get the, yeah. Last but not least here, we have a Street Fighter Loot Crate exclusive Hyper Looting Udon Capcom number one comic book. And there we go, November's Loot Crate. I'm actually pretty impressed with some of these pieces. The bobblehead's really nice, the Diablo figurine's really nice, and although I probably won't walk the streets wearing the Shredder Shades, still a pretty cool item. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Look forward to December's Loot Crate unboxing next month. Until next time, guys. Peace out.